With your first news at 6 Sports, here's Ben Dacu. The Bobcats didn't have to look very far to find their sixth round pick. They ended up selecting Century's Charlie Vig with the 198th pick in the NAHL draft. The speedy forward put up 47 points in 27 games in his junior season for the Patriots. There was a chance I was getting drafted, it wasn't for sure, but me and the boys were just sitting in the clubhouse and I was watching the draft and uh, my name popped up when Bismarck was picking and it was just super exciting because I was around all my friends and we all got really pumped up. It was pretty cool. It feels awesome. Get to play at the rink I grew up at, uh, get to go to school with my best friends and uh, you know, still playing Bismarck but with a new team. They're getting a great, a great player but an even better person, you know. I've been, we've been good family friends for a long time. I'm best friends with his brother Max and just as good as friends with him as well. And he's a great player, works his butt off and he earned every minute, of, every second of it. As it pertains to his hockey career, Charlie's next step is to attend the Bobcats main camp on July 12th. Before that though, he's got some work to do with the Govs. Govs are currently playing Minot in Bismarck and Charlie's got a couple of RBIs. They will play a doubleheader today. Bismarck is up eight zip in game one. Govs jumped all over the Vistas with a six run first inning. We're gonna have the highlights of game two for you at 10. Both the Big Sticks and Larks will be out of the state this evening. Badlands took the trip east to take on Wilmer. Sticks are looking to rebound after back-to-back -back losses against Bismarck. Meanwhile, the Larks are in Mankato to take on the Moondogs. Both games start at 635 Central. And a bit further east, the Twins will be playing the Oakland A's at Target Field in the Twin Cities. Minnesota has won three of their last four and will be hosting Oakland for this four-game series. This could be a good chance for the Twins to heat up. A's are last in the AL West and have lost five straight. And some basketball news. Former University of Jamestown forward Mason Walters attended a pre-draft workout with the Memphis Grizzlies. Walters is the Jimmy's all-time leading scorer and was the winner of the 2019 North Dakota Mr. Basketball Award. He played for the University of Wyoming last year. The NBA draft is on June 26th. And out in Edmonton, Game 3 of the Stanley Cup Finals is tonight at 7. Panthers are up two games to zero in this series thus far. The Oilers have been unable to solve the puzzle that is Panthers goaltender Sergei Bobrovsky. They've scored just one goal thus far in the series. A win tonight would give the Panthers a commanding 3-0 lead in the series. A team hasn't come back from a 3-0 deficit in the finals since the Toronto Maple Leafs in 1942. Add another layer to the ever-changing landscape of college athletics. Per Yahoo Sports, the Big 12 is considering selling off its naming rights to a corporate sponsor, which could drop the word big from its name. The conference is also interested in a private equity investment, per a report from CBS Sports. Well, it's all about the money, isn't it? It's all about the money. All right.